Welcome or welcome back to any help at C squared. In this example, we have a function, a piecewise function, and we need to find the value of x, if any, at which this function is not continuous. And whenever you have a piecewise function, like in this case, you want to take a look to this value. In this case, x equals to, we're going to look what's happened at x equals to is the function continuous at x equals to so for that reason i'm going to do first limit when x approach 2 minus of f of x to the left of 2 i want to see what's happened and in this case since i'm looking for number less than 2 i'm going to use the first piece of the piecewise function and in this one, I'm going to plug 2, so I'm going to have negative 1 plus 2, and that is positive 1. So, limit when x approach 2 minus is 1. Limit when x approach 2 plus of f of x. We're going to use a pretty similar approach. The only difference, since we're looking for number greater than 2, we're going to use the second piece of the piecewise function. And I'm going to plug 2 in it, so it's going to be 2 squared plus 1, and that will be 5. Now, if we take a look at these two limits, they are different, so that means the limit on x approach 2 of f of x does not exist. Why? Because the limits are different. If they are different, the limit doesn't exist. So, the first the second condition here is not accomplished, so that means f of x is not continuous at x equals 2. Yeah, f of x will be defined, and that will work, f of 2 in fact, that will be uh, 1. But the limit does not exist, and also the third condition, the limit at x approaching 2 and the value of the function are not the same. So this is also not accomplished, but only if you find one of them, like in this case, the limit does not exist, you know, the function is not continuous. The question is this discontinuity, removable or unremovable, because we notice these two limits are different, we know it's unremovable. If the limits are the same, then the discontinuity is removable. You can see that in the picture, and you see the jump, and that's the graphical reason for which this function is not continuous and this discontinuity is not removable. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help. Thank you.